Oh, snap. So let's move the titanium and the iridium back there. We're just almost out of zinc entirely. Okay. And let's fuel the launch thrusters with plutonium. Yeah. Fuel the launch thrusters. Okay. We don't have any iron for the pulse engines, so we'll need some iron at some point. Let's go check out this ruin, and then we'll, we'll go off planet. This is like 12 seconds away. It's a beacon. Sure. Some goodies over here. Yeah, okay. Viking Dagger. Another Shielding Shard. Alright. Beacon. Nice. There's more goodies in here, too. Okay. Alright, what is this beacon going to tell me? That's the question. Advanced life form detected. Oh, okay. Cool. I'll check that out. So we've got a convergence cube. We could go back to that outpost and talk to that guy again and receive a gift. I wonder what the gift is. I'm kind of curious. So let's let's actually do that. Let's actually do that. Where was that? We were just at. Right here. Okay. That's frustrating. There's a guy on the pad already. Alright. Maybe we can talk to this guy, though. Alright, let's see what this guy gives us. Ah, inventory full. Okay. Um, we can go ahead and charge with the power canister. Okay. Let's talk to you. Request gift. Life form agrees to help. What does he give me? Okay. Another. That's that was kind of worth it actually. I wonder if he'll do it again. I'm curious. Oh, yeah, cool. All right. Sweet. This guy's hooking us up, man. <laughs> He's giving us so much good stuff. Okay. Alright. That's fine. Um, okay. Wall. Alright. Darkness. Alright, let's go check out the uh, ruin, and then we'll go to the outpost, and then probably call it on this planet. Uh, I could sell the Viking Dagger. Why do I have one Plutonium? Yeah. Ship 
Okay. All right. Let's um put the shielding shard in our yeah. No free sh slots. No free slots. We're gonna discard zinc, and we'll keep the carbon because we need it. But we will stack the plutonium. There we go. Okay. All right. Now we have some free space. All right. Let's go to this ruin. Where was it? So that's there. The shelter. There was a ruin too. Did the shelter take? Look. This is what I mean about the waypoint system, right here. Oh, there it is. No, nope, that's a beacon. Where is the ruin that was given to me to go visit? This is exactly what I'm talking about with the waypoint system. Like, I don't know... One of them overrode the other, and for what? I don't understand why that, that would even happen. Doesn't make any sense. Does not make any sense at all. <clears throat> So yeah, we'll, we'll check out where that big planet has a lot of... Oh, no, that, that must be where the space station's at. I was going to say it has so many um, warp... Warp trails going to it. Pulse trails, whatever. Oh, nice, a pad. Okay. Sometimes it gives you the little, um, white cursor, and sometimes it doesn't. I don't know why that is, but... Hello. Okay. So we need to put these back in the ship. And this one too. Okay. Let's talk to this guy. Echo Analyst Entity Ronak. Traveler. Corvax Convergence. Something, something, something. Convergence. Something, something. Sharp metal needle emerges from the palm of the life form's hand. It moves so fast that it's already inches from my forehead before I can blink. Strange toxic looking goop dribbles down from its point and onto my visor. It hangs in the air above me while the entity waits for the order to plunge it deep into my brain. Um I think I think we would allow it, because we're an explorer. I receive reward and thanks, and indescribable levels of pain. Uh, beam intensifier tau. Sweet. Okay. I take damage. That's fine. I think there's a health restorative somewhere close by. Okay, so this has got... Is this worth it? So I've got a seven slot gun. Two slots more would be useful. Um, it's got beam intensifier theta. And I don't care about the ricochet. And then a combo fa combat amplifier. It might be nice to have a bigger gun, but I think I'm gonna not take it right now. I think my gun is fine. All right, we're gonna sell some junk. Let's get rid of this stupid Viking dagger. And Starship Inventory. Okay. Nothing worth selling in there. Okay, got the Corvax Standing Increase. Multi-Tool Tech. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Units. And that's something, too. Is that a Health Restorative, or...? Not that maximum. Okay. 
See, I, I think it should be more than just, you know, oh, you have an incredible amounts of pain. Like, it should actually affect your health if you let him stab you in the head with a needle. There should be some kind of um, consequence to it, is the way I feel. Let's go trigger this place. Destination reached. I haven't seen a lot of animals in this planet at all. Utnik more. Okay, let's go check out these buildings. That is a huge pile of gold. Boy, if we were the greedy type, that would be... I didn't realize this planet was actually cold at night. That's a big plutonium crystal. First aid. Credits. And multi-tool. Cool. Impact damage theta. Perfect. Alright, let's get over here and shoot this thing. I want this crystal. Okay, running away. Running away. Alright, so... I think we have time for one more planet. So let's go check... Let's go check out another planet. Um... Transfer some shielding shards. I just want one, actually. Let's say two. And then I want whatever. What else do I need in my suit? Some thamium, probably. Probably the thamium. Yeah, okay. Alright. So, let's go check out another planet. Check out this closest planet. Yeah, I just wanna I wanna see the planets in these systems, you know? Um I wanna see the planets in these systems, and then I eventually wanna travel back to the other planet that was so cool and build a base on it. Somehow how do I get- how do I find bases? That's the real question. Look that up. Look up the system for finding a base. Oh, insufficient fuel, okay. Alright, let's get some more fuel. These are sick, these asteroids. Very cool looking. Okay. Alright, we almost got there. Take off.
Alright, let me see. Uh, find base in no man's sky. Let's see if we can figure out exactly how... Build a signal booster to find a base. Okay, how do we build a signal booster? Can I even do that? Okay. I want to find a base on a planet in the other system that I just left. That was really cool. It was just a super cool planet. It had like giant creatures on it. Um, I really want to build a base there. I kind of like the idea of a base in the first system that I visited. This planet looks interesting. Very different than any of the other planets we've been to. I see aluminum. Scan reveals nothing of interest. Maybe there's nothing on this planet. That would be interesting. Oh, there we go. What's this? Ooh, a monolith. Okay, we're definitely checking that out. Right. Okay, it's a radio. Whoa! <laughs> Little beaver guy. Okay, let's make sure that none of these are aggressive. You look aggressive. Timid. Okay. Okay. Wow, so many creatures. Got a stegosaur over here. Okay. There's a red one over here. As long as we're all chill. That's a big one. this out. The Celatuma Essel Fragment. Light bursts from the obelisk. They pass through me. Lights burst from the obelisk. They pass through me, each a whispered Korvax secret buried for millennia within, deep within its rock. We are the Korvax Echoes, ever-enduring entities of the Convergence. We live on through the logic and wisdom passed through our metal skins. Each generation is greater than the last. See coupled language. So this is a Korvax system as well, I guess. Of course it is, because I've been meeting only Corvax. Okay. Um, this planet is interesting. I'm intrigued by it. But... Don't see much of value right at the moment. So let's get back in the ship. Let's take off. Okay. I, I need to see about that signal booster, huh? People, chat's telling me to build a signal booster if I want to find a base. Okay, that's like a camp. interesting because sometimes I'll be right next to something and it doesn't come up on the on the ship scan so there must be a um, you know like a scan fail 
a, a certain percentage of the time, the scan just must fail. And that's that, you know? Okay, here's a... Here's a spot I can check out. Doesn't seem the Lagris Badlands. Yeah, it looks like Badlands. So let's see about this signal booster. Well, first let's make sure that there's no creatures trying to kill us. Okay, timid. That looks slightly aggressive. Defensive, okay. I don't see that guy, it's so small. Okay. Radiation protection stabilizing. Oh nice. Alright, um hmm. Radiation protection stabilizing. Okay. That's cool, look at those. It's like a family. back in our ship. See this this there's two that are there's one that's a meat eater and one that's a plant eater and they look exactly the same. So um let's see. Where did I want to go? I wanted to get out of here. Um Oh, I wanted to test- yeah, okay, alright. Next planet, we'll check it out. This planet sucks anyway. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Alright. Oh, is there only two creatures left on that planet? Uh, that might have been worth doing, actually. That might have been worth doing. Did I just go to the same planet that I'm already, I've already been to? Yeah. Oh, snap. Let's get to the space station. Alright. I gotta fight you. Targeting is hard to do. Okay, I got him. Okay. Alright, so what can I recharge with? The shielding plate. Oh, the shielding shard did it just fine. Okay, so have I gotten these this shit this planet? Let's do that. Alright, well, we faced the pirate down. I I really do wish that there was a difficulty level between normal and and survival. Because I really feel like that would be more a more useful difficulty. Ah. Fooey. I yeah, guess we can get some iron here. Really?
I see what's going on. I'm just getting a little famine in there. Yeah, we're just gonna pulse to the space station, I think, and um, call this stream for the day. I've gotta, gotta go, gotta take off, but I will be back tomorrow morning. Be back tomorrow morning with more of this character. And enjoy some more No Man's Sky. I'm really, really having fun with um, just exploring and and I was playing survival mode before, and it was it. I liked the challenge, but it's just so difficult to get anywhere. And you and you don't enjoy your um, your time spent playing the game because. You're just desperately trying to not die all the time. So I'm I'm enjoying normal mode quite a bit. And I'll keep playing it for the moment. We might go back to survival mode at some point once I've seen a little bit more of the game. But I'm just gonna keep keep checking it out. Definitely keep going with this character. I want to build a base. I want to get Captain Kudo. Captain Kudo is this geck that I met in the first space station. He's amazing. I was like, no way, Captain Kudo. That's, that's his actual name. <laughs> he was pretty adorable, so. Hello. Hey, Corvax bros. Alright. Let's sell our stuff. See here. We have a neutrino module, but we can't sell it. Oh no! Okay, I see. What I see what it's saying. I get it. I get it. Sell trophium. Who needs that in their life? Uh, we can sell some plutonium. Since it's selling high, I think we probably should. Sell 500. Okay. Let's see what this guy can give us. Engineering Entity Pudo. Something, 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 something. We don't know any of these words. Okay. Electronic life form is processing a signal that emanates from a distant location deep in space. Endless processing units are combining to crack the code of a strange mathematical language. Rare elements are being pulled from the resource vaults at its feet, but some are running low. I feel bright lights constricting directly in your attention upon me. I think this is chrysonite. Oh, it was titanium. Shoot. So we gave him, we gave up our chrysonite for nothing. Amazing. I took a guess. There was no way to know. Um, oh wait, I think I know the word for silicates, so that would have word would have been in there. So yeah, I just screwed that up. Um, I might as well request fuel. What's he gonna give me? Ah, oh, some carbon. He gave me my carbon back and more. What's this other device? What does this device do? Can't get at it. Okay, and this guy's a builder deck, right? Yeah, okay. Met aliens. Builder. Can I get at this or not? Can I get it if I'm behind him? No, I can't even get behind him. Okay, alright, whatevs. And this guy is a scientist or something, right? Yeah. Scientist. Alright, okay. Moving on. 